What are segments and how to use them in Brevo? Hey everyone and welcome. I hope you're all doing great. In this video, we'll, we will be discussing about these segments uh, in Brevo and how to use them. So if we just go ahead and open up our Brevo.com here and we just go to contacts, we should find this section here which should say um, segments. So for segments, we can actually go ahead and use them uh, to basically create more um, you could say filters for our contacts. This way we can actually, you know, personalize the emails furthermore uh, using the segments. So we can actually go ahead and go to understanding filters and segments. And I just want to show you one thing here. Segments are personalized groups of contacts automatically generated by a set of conditions based, off, uh, based on attributes and or events. Um, so we are pretty much able to create many different segments for like many different uses as well. So we should have a few contacts or lists or whatever it may be, and we can just go ahead and segment them uh, accordingly. So let's just go ahead and show you how to do so. So uh, if I just go to contacts here, uh, do I have any contacts here? No, I will need to add some contacts and get back to you just so we can actually, um, or actually I do have some. Okay, so if we just go to segments here, uh, and we can just go to the top right corner where we, where we can click on create a segment. Now in here, we can actually go ahead and find some um, automation segments that are already built for me. So here we can see most engaged email subscribers. So this is going to only segment those who are very, very engaged with uh, our emails and stuff so contacts that clicked on a promotional message in the last 30 days uh, so it's just going to take those subscribers and only them and then you can also just send out campaigns to these individuals only uh, and we can also filter between uh, email marketing or demographics even so maybe you want to filter uh, or create segments from uh, a country code so this way you can actually uh, personalize the emails um, according to the country code. So you can just go ahead and use this one, for example, uh, and you can just go ahead and add the country code. So it starts with 971, which is the uh, UAE country code. Uh, and also we can add another one, which um, contact details. We can just go to uh, another, uh, where's the country code? Let me just search for uh, country code okay so apparently i can't really find it here maybe it's outside here uh country code okay never mind so we have these uh, other uh things that we can actually add but i'm just going to leave it as it is so only the country code for 971 uh and just click on save as a segment and this way we can just go ahead and give it a name uh which is uae contacts and we can just go ahead and set it up in any folder here. I'm just going to leave it as it is and click on create. And now basically we have the segment for UA contacts. And now we can get started adding people. Or actually, it's actually going to be added automatically for us. I mean, I'm very sorry. This is what actually makes segments a lot more unique than lists. Lists, you will need to add some lists and actually add people manually to them. But for segments, as you can see here, uh, people will just be added in here automatically because they have the country code 971 and we can also add more rules here uh, and then we can just always go to segments again and just click on create a segment and create segment from scratch uh, and we can just go ahead and get started by adding some filters so let's say uh, the filter that we want is from within the contact details and the um, let's say the time zone maybe we can just use this one or maybe uh when they were added or engagement status we have a lot of stuff that we can actually choose from or maybe even birthday maybe you want to only filter those who have a specific birthday for some reason so you have all these filters to choose from let me just you know select a random one so let's say first a uh, name is going to be john so whoever is actually named john is going to be added to that segment uh, automatically and you have a lot of filters to actually choose from and you also have either to add more filters like from here so deals sms email or you can add a, a completely different segment with an or 
uh, option. And then you can always just again save it as a segment and we are pretty much set. So hopefully you found this video to be helpful and thanks for watching.